babies, they're googly eyed, they drool, but are they actually more clued in than adults? For centuries, babies have been mistaken for a misshapen lump of consciousness that we adults just mold into our own image. But the last 20 years has really ushered in new information by cognitive psychologists about how amazing babies' brains really are. Cognitive psychologist Alison Gopnik says that babies are born into a buzzing, booming confusion of a world. I mean, think about it, everything is new to them. And they can't just pinpoint one or two things that they want to concentrate on, they take it all in, all of this information-rich data around us. Now, this makes them differently conscious than adults, and it results in this kind of lantern vision in which a wide swath of the world is illuminated for them. The reason is that babies' brains are pretty much marinating in neurotransmitters. This means that they are reacting to every little thing in their environment. And this is starkly different from adults whose neural connections have been pruned away over time. That gives us the ability to really focus in on things and it gives us that flashlight view as opposed to a lantern view of the world. We can illuminate the tiny little corners of our world and really kind of dig in and concentrate. Think about it. We operate under this illusion that we're always paying attention. But the truth of the matter is that our brains are really sort of creating this uh, 3D computational model for us, a kind of memory cheat sheet. So think about commuting to work, for instance. You pull your car into your parking space at work. You feel like you paid attention the entire time. But the fact of the matter is, is that you could have actually passed something like a yellow rhinoceros and not even have noticed it. But it's very likely that our flashlight-like consciousness was occupied by something else and wouldn't have seen it. But that baby in the back seat, well, she is absolutely awestruck by every single little raindrop glinting on the windshield, every train whistle, every honking horn of a car. She sees the yellow rhinoceros and she has stared into its eyes. This is probably why she's not driving, by the way. So what else can we learn from babies? That they're differently conscious from us adults. In fact, even more conscious. And that's just the tip of the iceberg because babies, when they are born, they are pre-packaged with an operating system with all sorts of abilities, like the ability to count and the ability to acquire new languages at breakneck speeds. So what else might they be hiding from us? So what about you? Do you move through the world taking everything in or do you rely more on a 3D computational model? Let us know in the comments below and make sure to subscribe for more mind-blowing videos.